Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's video is going to be a quick comparison between the Clear Jelly Stamper Big Bling and the Creative Shop Hollow Glassy Stamper. So if you're interested in seeing the differences and the similarities between the two, please keep on watching. So in my nail stamping lifetime, I have tried quite a few of the stampers that are available out there from squishy stampers to other clear stampers, sticky stampers, different colors and from different brands. Um, I started out with um, Westonia and Born Pretty. I have uh, stamping or stampers from Dixie Plates, Conad, uh, Queen, Moyu London, Sissy and Sissy. And the one that I always went back to is the Clear Jelly Stamper Big Bling. So you can say that this was, or this is still, um, a holy grail stamper for me. So when Creative Shop came out with their own clear or clear jelly, or I guess they call it something different, um, their hollow glassy stamper, I was intrigued. Um, at first, I didn't know whether I should purchase it because is it just going to be the same as the clear jelly? They look very similar. Um, the difference between the heads is that the creative shop has a hollow in it but i thought is it going to be similar as the clear jelly so for my birthday i went ahead and got it uh, from lantern and wren and now i can bring you a comparison between the two so what do you actually get when you get the stampers for the clear jelly stamper big bling what you get is the stamper itself right here and a scraper card which i love their scraper card this is the only one i continually use i have so many scraper cards from different companies um but this is the one that i use the most because of the stiffness of it and this probably probably should be in frame right because of the stiffness of it and the size i think it's perfect it's not too small it's not too big it's just perfect um, so you get the stamper itself and a scraper card from the clear jelly stamper big bling for creative shop this one is a little bit more expensive because you get the stamper itself with an extra stamping head two scraper cards and two scraper cards I should say um, but just so you know that the creative shop is actually available with no extra stamping head and two scraper cards for $10.99. Let me double check that. I believe that's right. Yep. Um, $10.99 from if you get it from Beautometry. I got both of my stampers from Lantern and Wren. And the one that Lantern and Wren sells for the Creative Shop Hollow Glassy Stamper has an extra stamping head for $16.99. So that's what you get if you purchase the stampers themselves. So the question is, is there really a difference between the two? I mean, they're so similar. Packaging wise, they're so similar. Um, obviously the clear jelly big bling has bling at the bottom and the, uh, creative shop one does not, but they're the same size. They're interchangeable and the same goes with top lid. So they're almost identical except for the stamping head. That is really where the difference is. And I don't know if you can tell. But the 
uh, Creative Shop one almost has a yellow tinge to it. The clear jelly is a lot clearer. I don't know if that's because this has hollow in it and it affected the clarity, but that's not even really the main difference between the two. The main difference between the two is on how they feel. Um, the big bling is squishy. So is the uh, creative shop one, but uh, this creative shop one is stickier. Like it's actually stickier than the big bling. I would almost call this a sticky clear jelly stamper compared to this one. And because this is stickier, it actually picks up better. Like, um, the clear jelly big bling, there's a learning curve in figuring out how to pick up images with it. Like, it has to be a flick of the wrist, as they say. Um, it has to be gentle pressure and flick of the wrist very quick. When it comes to the clear, uh, the creative shop, it's easier to pick up images with it because it's sticky. I don't know how to explain it and how they did that, but it's stickier. So that's the main difference between the two. Um, if you can take into account the pricing and the how many scraper cards do you actually get, but really the main difference is on the stamper head, uh, stamping heads. And I think the Creative Shop is better because it's a sticky clear jelly stamper. That picks up images better. Um, now whether you prefer that or not. It's up to you. Some people prefer squishy sticky stampers. Some don't. But. What I can say is that. The creative shop one. Has definitely replaced the big bling for me. Because it picks up better. Like you can tell. like It's sticking to my finger right now. Compared to this. It's just letting go. But this one is sticky. See? Isn't that crazy? I didn't know that was possible to have a sticky clear jelly. But there you go. Creative Shop has did it, has done it, and it's amazing. And I love it. So that's the main difference between the two for you. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was informative for you. If you are trying to decide on whether to get... Um, the clear jelly stamper or the creative shop one or if you already have the creative shop or not the creative shop the big bling and you're wondering like is it worth purchasing another clear jelly clear stamper from a different brand i would say try it and see because holy cow i was i was surprised by this i thought it was just going to be another um clear jelly stamper that really has no difference whatsoever but other than the hollow but it's actually different so try it out and see let me know if you like it or which one you like better and thank you for watching my video bye guys